When she goes grocery shopping, Kimberly Keller sticks to a routine to make sure her bag doesn't disappear. I tie my bag literally to the shopping cart and don't turn away from it. I have my hand on it all the time. Egg Harbor Township Police say the pair seen in these surveillance images are among the thieves who have used the art of distraction in order to steal. I don't want to be a victim. Cops here seeing a recent uptick in these crimes at local shopping centers. At least four cases in the past couple weeks. The thieves often working in teams. Who are they targeting? They're targeting single females that are shopping alone. When one suspect will come and distract, the female and the second suspect will come and take the purse. Investigators say at times their tactics involve talking in a different language to confuse the victims, causing them to turn away. In the parking lot, one thief tells a shopper getting in her car that she dropped something on the ground. When she goes to check, a second crook swipes her purse from the passenger seat. Now it's the holiday season, people are looking for money and they're trying to blend in and there's more people shopping and more people in the stores. It's absolutely ridiculous. It's supposed to be a happy time and people are ruining it for them. One more thing to worry about. If you recognize these guys, police want to hear from you. They say often in these types of cases, the thieves are from out of town. Where do you think they're coming from? It's hard to say they'd be coming from New York, Philadelphia. My way is just to be more observant of your surroundings. Make sure that if you are carrying a purse, keep it on your shoulder, keep clutches on your attached to your wrist. You just have to keep everything on you and focus on everything around you. You can't, you have to pay attention to everything. Everything and everyone, including crooks shopping for victims. Ted Greenberg, NBC 10 News.